Yeah, but they it was originally an N64 only title, but then they decided to bring it to the GameCube, and then after they brought it to the GameCube, they decided to port it to the Wii. So, either way, it got around, but it didn't sell the best out of the three Nintendo exclusives. Uh, I'm just I'm just putting Billy up here so he doesn't waste my handgun ammo. Because he, he does that from time... I'm just putting Billy up here so the AI doesn't get attacked, well, so he doesn't get attacked by zombies. Because, uh, I, they do do that sometimes. But, yeah, like, it sold pro I think it sold the least out of the Nintendo exclusives. Well, yeah, it did, because, uh, Shinji Mikami promised that he would, like, eventually at one point promised that he would, uh, release three Nintendo exclusives, which one was the Resident Evil remake, the other one was RE0, and then there was the GameCube Resident Evil 4, but, um, 2 and, two and 4, so, uh, I mean, uh, 0 and, uh, 4, 0 didn't sell that well. 0 didn't sell that well out of all three of them. Looks like there's a passenger cabin below, crack, down, down below the crack, jump through the crack. Now, 0 sold the, I, I think the worst out of, like, the least out of all of them. And four sold the most, and remake sold the uh, the uh, best. I think I, no, it's, I'm second best. That was it. Jewelry box, pick that up. Might as well examine it. It looks like a case for holding jewelry. Open it, and there's the second. There's the silver ring. We took it. Is there anything else in here that I should get? Uh, here's a knife for Rebecca, but there's no point in taking it. There's just, the only reason they give it, give you that is to knife the leeches coming up. Even though RE4 isn't really a Nintendo exclusive anymore because it got ported to the PS2, and then it got ported to the, then it got ported to the PC, and then it got ported to the I'm pretty sure it got. I, I'm pretty sure it's on the Xbox, like original. I'm not sure about that though. But it got ported to the PC, ported to the P PS2, and eventually ported to the Wii. And Billy obviously is going to try to shoot them because he's an idiot. Now we're going to exchange that. We're going to combine. Then we can open that for a second. But let's take all that ammo, combine it, examine this. Briefcase has been unlocked. Open it, and we get the magnetic card, I'm pretty sure. There's something inside. Blue card, key card. Now that we have this, we're pretty much good. But, uh... Now we just have to make it back. Okay. And leeches are on me, so... I hope Rebecca was smart enough to leave the leeches alone and follow me here. Yes, she was. That's good. Because sometimes she doesn't, and it's not exactly... Shoot him off me. Okay, leave him alone. Just run. Yep, and Billy's back in caution, but that's what this green herb is for. No, not, not combined, use. And then we're going to want to give Rebecca some ammo so she can. And then give it back, and we're good. Now we're going to save. Saving just in time. Now, we're, we don't need the hook shot anymore, so you can drop the hook shot anywhere you really feel like it. Because, uh, well, we do need it for one other thing, but you don't need it until later on. So just drop it in the hallway. It, it, it'll, it'll be there when we need it, so. And since Rebecca has the lowest amount of inventory, we're gonna obviously have her pick up the ink ribbons, but Billy has the key card, right? Yeah, okay. We're gonna have her pick up the ink ribbons, and then we're gonna use them... 
There's a typewriter, record data, and that concludes today's session of Let's Play Resident Evil Zero. I'll see you guys later.